you guys we need to talk we really actually need to talk uh so much has been going on uh, so many people have been saying so many things and i feel like it is time to address it because things are getting out of control it's confirmation look you learn from it you got to see the I see he's in shock he <laughs> do you see how she made a comment did you hear she was watching him to see what his uh, what his reaction would be. And let me tell you this now. She's noted it in her mind. Oh, man, I'm telling you, you guys who don't know, you'll be divorced very soon. I promise you, I don't want to see people get divorced. But it's these little things that people don't realize is happening. <sighs> Most of the things that are being said out here, it's not as it seems. And it is so, so unfortunate that some Kenyans have taken it literally and they have decided to attack Wodemaya. Guys, Wodemaya is being attacked left, right, and... Hi, guys. Welcome back uh, yet to another big episode. So today, guys, we'll be talking about one of the biggest YouTubers here in Africa. And uh, at the moment, I see one of the biggest YouTubers. I know, guys, you know, who am I referring to? So I'll be talking about Wodemaya and... Uh, I missed two days. So for a couple of days, we have been experiencing uh, a back talk here and there. Uh, most people talking about them and saying that uh, Miss Toby and what may have defaulted. Uh, but guys, we are here with the truth after doing a small research uh, on the issue. So guys, uh, the issue of the matter is that uh, Miss Toby decided to uh, do a video uh, uh, trying to discuss the whole issue and what was really happening. So uh, during uh, this video that she did, uh, she talked about a couple of stuffs and they will be going through them because they have uh, some pointers to what she talked about. So uh, this is what she started with. Uh, she talked or she discussed about uh, why she was not uh, and all why she didn't do a big wedding compared to what what Maya did uh, for uh, his sister. So uh, she says that uh, she didn't uh, she didn't want a big wedding and uh, that's why they did have a quite big a budget as uh, to what what Maya spent. Uh, to his sister because most people saying were saying that Wodemaya has a lot of money and uh, uh, he was supposed to spend uh, quite some good amount of money on their wedding rather than a uh, hundred a thousand dollar for a wedding so that's how she came uh, for her events saying that uh, they just needed a simple wedding uh, so that uh <clears throat> yeah she said that they just needed a simple wedding uh for her defense then apart from that uh she came out <clears throat> uh, saying that uh, she does respect uh couples who are married from different countries because there's uh, diversity in terms of culture and also other stuff like food uh, yeah, guys, in short, there is a very big difference. So she says that she really respects uh, such kind of couples because, as you know, uh, those are among us the big challenges. Because when you are married to a different country, uh, you are not used to food, uh, uh, maybe uh, to the climatical conditions of the other country. So she said that she will. I respect that kind of couple. Then she came out uh, to defend herself because previously she had said she don't need a man. And guys, uh, she came out uh, to say that you guys uh, took this a wrong way because that's what she, uh, that's not what she meant. She meant that she's a hardworking woman uh, who is uh, not dependent to any uh, person, although. Uh, what am I, uh, is everything uh, to her so that's what she said on the same then apart from that uh, uh, she came out to defend what am I, because as you know uh, when they were in Miami uh, she was left alone that's the moment they met with Tayo 
if you can call. So uh, she said that uh, Wadima had an issue back at home. So he had to rush home uh, because his mom was not well. So uh, that's why she was left at uh, in Miami. Then she followed him immediately uh, because, as you know, if there is an uh, uh, an urgent issue which needs to be solved, the, uh, you can't just do uh, that issue uh, to of you because, as you know, they were doing shooting. So at that moment, uh, Wademeyer was supposed to go and check the mom. Then. Miss Tuldi follows uh, uh, back, and that's what they did. So apart from that, is that uh, uh, she says that they were not, they are not a perfect couple. They are still learning. So uh, whatever challenge they are facing, they know they are on a learning process. So that's how she came to her defense. Then apart from that is that most people said that uh, she really forced issues or she forced the things uh, to be married by none other than the biggest YouTuber here in Africa, uh, Wademaya. So uh, most people say that uh, she really loves uh, Wademaya than uh, he really loves her. So uh, she said that she never forced the issues uh, this is something that they to they talked about, and uh, uh, what we have is a mutual agreement between um, her and Wademaya. So guys, and apart from that, uh, she says that she's not happy, uh, but uh, uh, her not being happy has not been caused by none other than Wademaya. So she said that whatever uh, whatever she has uh, uh, currently in life was uh, an impact from none other than Wademeyer because uh, Wademeyer is uh, the person who encouraged her uh, to do the content creation. Uh, but uh, guys, this uh, not being happy has not been caused by Wademeyer. So she said that uh, just don't judge Wademeyer. Uh, they are perfectly in love together and they have not divorced that's uh, what you're seeing online is just kind of gossips and rumors so that's it until next time see you on the next one as we uh, exploit more from miss trudy because she's currently in the bamboo so bye bye see you on the next one